This is Planet Earth. Have you ever wondered what it was like inside? Let's take a look. If we strip away everything on the surface, we can see the crust. The darker parts are oceanic crust, the lighter parts are continental crust. The crust of the Earth varies in depth from 5 to 70 kilometers. Oceanic crust ranges in depth from 5 to 10 kilometers. The crust is solid and made largely of granite and basalt. Let's strip away the crust. Here we have the upper mantle. The mantle is the largest part of Earth's structure. The upper mantle is about 25 kilometers and is the most active part of the mantle. Mantle material that works its way through the crust is what makes volcanoes. This material is in a liquid state. Beneath the upper mantle is the lower mantle, which is approximately 2,855 kilometers deep, which is the distance from San Antonio, Texas to Boston, Massachusetts in a straight line. At this depth, the heat and pressure the mantle of the Earth is under causes the rock to be in a plastic state. This means it is solid but flows and moves when external pressure is applied. The next layer is the outer core. Because the outer core is made of different materials than the mantle, it is in a liquid state. The inner core is a solid ball of iron and nickel, and a recent study indicates that it may be a single iron crystal, which may explain some of Earth's magnetic field anomalies.